Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Thomas Was Alone. This is going to be episode 2 of this fantastic series that I'll be bringing to you straight from my bedroom because that's where I record games, I guess. So anyways, we will be starting off on Origin 2.2. .2. And so in 2.1 we met Claire. A large blue cube with a self-esteem problem, but she learned that she is buoyant, and so she believes that she She'd has super need powers. a cape. There was no getting around that. You couldn't be a superhero without a cape. Claire didn't want confusion. Okay. If you saw a cape, that made matters clear. You knew what you were dealing with. Claire was all about communication. Hey, look at them. And, all right. you know, floating in water. <laughs> which was her superpower. Claire and John are teaming up here. Can I walk? Okay, cool. So maybe... Oh, okay. So how I used John to move Claire, I'll be moving... I'll be using Claire to move John. Makes things a little bit easier for us both. I like how these two are working together. That's, uh, that's a good team. I like that. Uh-oh. Is Claire here? Yeah, she is. <laughs> right! Fear not, my skinny friends, for I am Claire, and I will save you. Yeah, you will, dear. Okay. Claire needed to come up with a superhero name as soon as possible. Claire was rubbish. <laughs> you be super Claire. Okay, so let's get John, get all these jabronis on there, and we will move across. And we will just... Oh, I can't jump with all of them at once, so let's do this. Right in order. Not a problem at all. There we go. I got some storms going on outside my window right now, and I hope that doesn't pick up on the microphone. I don't think it will. It's kind of quiet. But, you know, thunder is thunder. Okay. 2.4. arrived just in time. Yeah, you did. It was, of course, the perfect moment for superheroes to arrive. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if that was necessary. I guess the water is just... Oh, okay, the water is always going to rise. That's neat. So, we will get Thomas on top of Claire. Ooh, sexual. Okay, just kidding. They're shapes, guys. They probably don't have orifices in which to insert each other. As the water began oh. to rise, Claire vowed to save this little rectangle in as many restarts as it took. Ah, uh, see? That is that's exactly what Thomas needed this entire time. Someone who cares about him. Claire, Claire wondered that's if you. Thomas would make a good sidekick. He would. Was she more the Lone Avenger type? Uh oh. She'd like that. Whoa, that was close. A soul hero in a world of rectangles and conveniently placed pools of toxic water. Ha <laughs> ha. I know. I think Thomas is a good... He'd be a good backup superhero. What do they call him? Sidekicks? Yeah. Okay. Alright. So what to do here? I suppose I can do this and jump up with him. Claire, get your sweet booty over this way. And we will just rinse and repeat. The others told Claire that staircases were a bit of a fixture here. <laughs> Claire wondered why the world made it so difficult. Everyone is up. Everyone is happy. John, get your skinny butt up here. And let's continue on. Claire, hurry up. Okay, <laughs> you made it. Barely, it seems. All right. Let's get you in here. Chris and John, we will float. Your oh, shit. <laughs> Oops. Didn't mean that. Oh, gosh. Crazy lightning outside. My house, not your house. Maybe it's outside your house. I hope my computer doesn't freaking fry. That'd be god awful. This is what I risk for you people. What do you mean, you people? Well, I'm sorry, YouTube subscribers. Didn't mean to Probably classify you like that. A villain who would show their true colors at the worst possible moment, hurting all she held dear. You don't need a villain. Chris was the most obvious. <laughs> He seemed stroppy enough. His jump was so pathetic that it conveniently avoided Claire's insecurities. Yeah? Yes. Chris 
Diabolical Chris. The fiendish Christopher. <laughs> Suck it, Chris. That's what you get for being a jerk your whole life. Okay. So, we will set sail. Set a course for across the river, stream, poison, death, land. Alright, let's go, Claire. Super Claire. I'm sorry. Oh, oh my god, I didn't think I could jump there. That's funny. <laughs> that kind of... Whoa, that was weird. Almost. Thought I was almost going to lose these guys. But they're safe and sound. Now we're just going to need to jump up one more time with our little rectangular and square brothers. Oh no, oh no. There you go, Chris. Thomas, you're up next. John, get in your home. And finally, Claire. Set sail across the river once more. Good job. What are we up to this time? Hey. Oh. Where had Chris gone? Hmm. Was he off somewhere? Plotting Claire's downfall? I don't know. I hope he's okay. If Claire was honest, and she had to be because she was a superhero, this was a troubling turn of events. I mean, you did a... Uh... Still, there were reasonably sized bodies of water to cross. Sure. Well, Chris was kind of a jerk the whole time, so maybe he got his comeuppance. But until then, I guess we don't know. But Claire and John did a level together, and Chris wasn't even there. Chris actually wasn't even in addition until fairly recently, I guess. Well, and the, when you're having all these compatriots together, I suppose. Okay, so let's get her down here first. Nothing much digging on here. Okay. It seems relatively safe for the other gents to accompany Claire on the way down. Let's see here. Okay. And John. Get you a skinny little butt down here. And let's finish the level. Hmm. What is... Moving platforms over water, eh? Claire's newly heightened senses told her that there were multiple paths across with various possible configurations of the little posse. Huh. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do this time. going to pretty much have everyone just jump on top of Claire, and we will all move as a group together. What is the, what are those things? Did it just beep at me? They did. I don't know what that does. They were doing oh, no. really well. <laughs> Claire hoped she could get them all across. John was fully aware he could do this alone. Thomas hoped he'd never have to. Oh, this game is so depressing sometimes. Like, I'm, I feel like so bad for Thomas. Alright, so I can't jump. Don't push us off. Okay, whatever. I guess I can just... Let's do this with these two guys first, and then I'll get Claire across maybe sometime soon. There we go. Okay, you guys move out of the way. Claire! No, Claire! Oh, well, she could float. There we go. Okay. So, John, Thomas, you could jump over them, right? Okay, good. 2.9. Claire? You're all alone. Uh, those spikes will probably hurt. Claire was alone. Which was odd. Because she wasn't meant to be alone. She needed to be where there were rectangles to save. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. Being the only superhero in a given space kind of defeats the object. <laughs> the spikes? Oh no. That was new. Claire avoided them. Hmm. She decided they were most likely her kryptonite. Not the rubbish red kryptonite either, the proper radioactive green stuff. <laughs> <laughs> what is... Can I do something? I, I don't get it. I don't... Why are they, why are they here? Why does it do something when I pass it? 
Oh, maybe that's the checkpoint. You think? I'm thinking it is. That makes sense then, I guess. I thought they rotated to the screen or something. But, hey. Okay. So, same level. Only got my boy Thomas here. So let's go, buddy. If it's anything like the first level, Deja vu. we could probably just do the, the level. Was repeating, and this time Thomas was here. Okay. Claire felt something had gone wrong. Wait a minute. There was a disturbance in the force. Huh. Something had altered the matrix. <laughs> the world was reacting to their progress. It was amassing its forces. Is that it was bad? Oh no. Against them. I don't hope. I don't want it to plot Claire. against me. Finally had a nemesis. Oh. Okay, so Thomas. How are we gonna do this, buddy? Oh, okay, never mind. I'm just I'm dumb. I was thinking too much into this. So if I move him, Thomas will just Okay, no, I guess it doesn't matter anyways. I was thinking if I just killed Thomas right there, he would start off behind me anyways. But, me and him, we got a good... Oh! We used to have a good thing going on <laughs> until I... Okay, so that proved that point is... That is the uh, checkpoint. So let's get down here once more. You're going to move Thomas a little bit over to the side because... Claire, she might be able to Oh yeah, she is able to jump over him. Silly me. Okay. This is the start of episode three, I think? Well, not episode three. Just, no. I'm not starting, I have built protective systems. You guys are gonna have to read that, because I ran out of time. It investigates, captures, and removes from play. I guess I didn't run out of, really, really run out of time. Gosh, I'm moving ahead of myself, which is kind of not that strange, really. Oh, we're following. 3.1, okay. Wait a minute. Who's that long fellow? What is? Laura was pleased oh. this one was behind a wall. Maybe he'd never know what she could do. Huh? Maybe, maybe they could just have a conversation. Hang out. Laura? Nice to meet you, as Laura. As long as he didn't find out what she could do. Which would never happen. So long as they stayed separate. What can you... I don't... Alright. Laura, you are very mysterious, my lady. Huh. See, little curiosities, I'm gonna stop. It's just like, little curiosities like that are just... It's... Like, this. she has a secret, but she's just a rectangle on its side. It's awesome. Let's going on here? Laura didn't have time to worry about the ominous pixel cloud. What? It had been following her for some time and it had kept itself to itself until now. What pixel cloud? Hmm. More important was the little orange thing, which hmm. was looking at her in a way that she kind of, well, liked. Why would... Oh! Trampoline, Laura. She likes Chris? It's kind of a dick. As the square, who had shyly introduced himself as Chris, bounced atop Laura, she mm. began to worry that he was just using her like all the others had. They'd all bounced too, and then they disappeared when her back was turned. Oh. I'm not gonna disappear. Chris might. Well, probably not. He might take a fancy to you. Which would be freaking awesome because Only he the ominous life. pixel cloud ever remained, looking a little bigger and a little less hungry with every disappearing friend. I don't... Wait, the pixel cloud's eating people. Maybe that's the nemesis. Alright, what to do? Okay, move. With every bounce, Laura found herself less and less irritated by Chris. <laughs> she started to miss him when he wasn't there. On another platform or something. Hmm. Let's get Chris up here. And that will elevate that. Did I? Okay, no. Okay. 
I was thinking that maybe it was a pressure thing and maybe it will not come down. What was up to? Was he missing her? Huh? huh. He wasn't saying very much. Laura! Looks like you got yourself a little crush, dear. Uh-oh. What? No! Alright, Laura, you're gonna have to move a little bit over. There we go. There we are. Rain is rain. Looks like I'll be able to sail right at Oh! You see that? Wait a minute. Oh. Okay. Chris was in love. She was perfect. <laughs> he had to tell her so. At some point, he would definitely tell her. Get over Probably here. Probably best to wait for a moment the large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about, though. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. Probably best to wait. Okay. So, here, if I just bounce, I'm kind of screwed. So what I'm gonna do is use... Oh. Where'd it go? Oh, he can't... He just dies anyway. Or he doesn't die, he just can't do it. But I'm gonna use Laura as kind of like a platform thing to make sure I don't fall. So I can just jump, you know, as, pretty much as far as over as I would like without having to worry about me falling off. It takes a little while, but... It's probably worth it. Just better safe than sorry. Although I really just kind of want to get this over with. Because that's how I go. And if you've ever seen my Tower Climb series, you will understand how rush of a person I can be sometimes. Just trying to get to the end with, you know, without having to worry about, or with, yeah, with reckless regard for my own self. But with these guys... You know, maybe I'll be a little bit nicer and have them, have them at least have a chance. Okay, so I have this. I'm just gonna go now. There we go. Okay, that was much easier. Should have just done that the whole time, but hey, you know, you win some, you lose some. Hey, everyone. Let's see. Let's get John over here. Oh. Let's move Thomas. Thank you, John. Chris was massively disappointed to run into the gang again. Why is he so He enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. Whatever, man. You're just a jerk. Always will be. Okay. So, I want Chris to get on top of Thomas. There we go. Because all these... The rest of everyone can make it up there just fine. But what am I going to do with... Uh, I guess I'll figure out something when I press this block. There we go. So they fall down. And... I'm going to need Chris for this one. No, wait. Hold on. Back up. There we go. And here. Now we can pick Chris. We got some more maneuver room. You know, maybe it'll be the help to the team. Was it too early to refer to Laura as his girlfriend? Yeah, probably was. Only if I say it out loud, <laughs> he told himself. Hey. He didn't want to scare her off. That's kind of neat. How did... How did... You guys can't bounce anymore? It's only when Thomas bounces on Chris? Okay. Whatever you guys say. Alright, let's go, John. Let's show these small little guys what you're made of. Made out of awesome. Made out of pure freaking awesome, John. Tall, skinny, you're just like me. You got a sense of adventure. Or something. Oh, okay, she's on her little thing. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, sometimes they lose control. You gotta lose control. You gotta rock your socks. The you're gonna roll your soul. suspicious of Laura. And the eager-looking pixel cloud of death which seemed to be watching her. Hmm. Sure, they'd use her inherent bounciness to reach slightly higher jump points, but they wouldn't strike up a conversation with her. We wouldn't? Chris found them rude. Oh. Rude? And always there. Why is he... He's got such a problem, man. Okay. Oh. I'm like, what... 
for some dumb reason, I was like, what do I do here? Then it dawned on me that I'm just dumb. Pure dumb. Alright, so let's... Nope. Laura. Jump up there. Again. Sweetie. Pumpkin. Dearest. Peach pie. Cobbler. Don't know what that even is supposed to mean. But I'm going to use this determined deer it for my significant other at some point. Because it's a good one. And one more. Maybe. <laughs> I was going to say, maybe I'll call my future significant other Laura. But I don't think that would uh, float too well if her name was anything but. I'm, I'm willing to give it a shot. John, you're not over yet, my friend. We're going to need you to track this lovely lady across. Thank you. Laura, thank you for letting everyone ride you so hard. <laughs> See what I did there? Made a joke. Alright. So, almost have everyone here. We need... The others wouldn't drop it. Who's that cloud guy? Why is he following us? What's that rumbling hungry sound he keeps making? <laughs> Chris, can we just leave Laura behind? Who's saying that? No one's saying anything about leaving Laura behind. What is... What's going on here? I just want to jump up. So, John, you can do that. Do I need... Ah, how am I going to do this? I don't know. Sure, I'll figure it. Oh! She fell off. Don't fall off things. Why you got to fall off? So as long as I get them on this top one, then I'm good. I'm thinking everyone can do that as well. So let's try this. Let's get Thomas in here. And we will get the two tards. No, we'll just stick with Chris right now. Sorry if this is going to take a little long, but, you know, you can deal with it. <laughs> what a terrible thing for me to say. Ah, just deal with it, don't matter. Rub some dirt in you, you're fine. <laughs> but seriously, this is gonna take a little while. Not a long while, just a little while. That's why it's called a little while. Okay, you get over there. And you are almost done, Laura. There's two more elevator rides. One more elevator ride. Let's make sure rude. you have enough room to get up. Why is everyone so rude? I don't get it. Why do these guys have such a problem with each other? Just be bros. They're all a bunch of weird things. Might as well be cool weird things together. That's my philosophy on life. <laughs> Who knows if it's good? I sure don't. Alright. Is there anything I can do? Yep. Okay. You guys... Heading up there. Laura, how are you going to get up there? How is Laura going to get up there? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm. Very interesting. I don't know. I have no, no idea. She can't exactly do... Oh, wait. I am so dumb. She can jump. I don't know why I think that she's just like this board that can't do anything. But let's do this. So jump, jump, jump. Hmm. Can you jump? No. Can you jump? Okay. Alright. But Thomas can't make you jump. But Chris can't. Not that that does anything. So, maybe. Okay. We will do this. There we go. Okay. Oh, God! What just happened? I think I broke it. <laughs> Am I supposed to do that? Oh, if not, then. Oops. My bad. 
Oh no, I messed this up too. Chris, jump up here. Jump up there too. Alright, we're fine. We're looking good. Chris, nope, you missed. No! Messing up everything. Okay. Ah, oh, no. I keep... I hate that you can't pick who you want to tab to. You kind of have to go through everyone. And that just messes me up, because I always want to tab over to whoever I want to pick. But that just mostly never the case. And is this just me guessing? Yeah, okay. Just happened to work out well for me there. What is now? I can go over here. Claire's back. Hi, Claire. Everyone's here, actually. Huh. Okay. So, gonna need. Okay. Just kidding. Let's get Chris up here. Chris. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. Shit. These ones seem to be she sticking died. around too. I died. Not like those losers from before. Okay, so she's not mad at us? I'm so I don't know. Couldn't keep up who was she who was like yelling the last time. But apparently it wasn't us. So I want Thomas to go over on this side because Laura's gonna need some room. To maneuver. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. Damn it. These ones okay. seem to be sticking around too. <laughs> Not like those losers from before. Alright. So. I have no idea if this is gonna work. Claire! Claire! No! No! Ah. Alright. One more shot, we'll see. It's like I'm navigating through five different people with one button, so it just takes a long time for that to actually happen. Laura liked her new gang. So what if she I just liked Chris? She liked having friends. Did this These ones seem to be right sticking here. around too. Not like those losers from before. And I will I guess I'm gonna put you here and you will come here and everyone's just gonna bounce on Laura. She's just getting rude. Whoa, okay, that's neat. So I want Claire over here, so I'm going to need Thomas and Chris a little bit over as well. And I think that'll be enough to bring everyone up. Hopefully. That's how I see this going anyways. Actually, I'm probably going to need John down here. Okay. So. What? I know. I hear it. It's... All right, you're good. Thank you. Chris, jump up here. Um. Thomas. Maybe I can get Claire in on this. So Claire, get over here. And you over here. And you over here. And you over here. And let's try this one more time. There we go. Right is right. Is Chris still angry at everyone? I hope not. And just two, just the girls left. If you can call them girls, because they're really just shapes. Okay. Uh-oh. 310. 
What do I want to do here? Let's... The pixel cloud was getting closer. Whoa. It was spending more and more time hovering around. Hmm. Laura could tell it was making the others uncomfortable. So that makes that move. Can this demon thing kill? Is it running into any of those things in the middle? Doesn't look like it, no. Oh, I can't. Okay. So, John is going to go here. Laura, I will get you up first. Don't die, don't die. Oh, you, you, you died, Laura. Okay, let's try this again. You up first. This shouldn't be hard, right? It doesn't look too, too bad. So now I want Chris. And hopefully Chris doesn't die. So Laura just scooch. Chris is there. Be my girl. Thank you, Claire. You are, have been wonderful, as always. Let's move Chris over just a bit to make room for John. Actually, let's do Thomas first. And then now we'll do John. Oh, this isn't going to work. <laughs> I guess I could just went up that way. But that's okay. Like, I'm, I'm just being consistent. Oh, what the? What do you mean, no? I made that. I didn't jump for whatever reason. Don't like that. Just get out there. Okay. Chris and Thomas. And we'll watch this. No simulation can support too many entities. At a certain point, something has to give. If Thomas AT23612 hadn't possessed those exact personality traits, it's likely the story would have ended there. Alright, so we're going to end here on 4.1. And I will be back next time, whenever that will be, um, and finish off this chapter. But, as always, thank you guys so much for watching the video. I had a blast, as always, playing with you all. And I love this game, and I encourage anyone out there who plays, or who sees me playing it and liking it, uh, go and support some indie devs. I have the link in the comments, so check that out. If you need to talk to me outside of Twitter, or <laughs> outside of YouTube, uh, my Twitter account is jsmith underscore OTI. If you need to talk to me on YouTube, just leave me a comment and I'll see if I can get back to you guys. But until then, I'll see you later. Bye.